Yo, it's your boy Pinoy, back at the LC LEC studio, back at it again with Caps, recaps with Caps. So uh, Caps, it was a very interesting series against uh, Schalke. How do you feel after the match? So we all, you never know what will happen in the best of fives, but we were hoping for a bit of a cleaner series. Uh, game three, we were talking about if we should ban the, of course, the TSM bans, or we should uh, like miss out the ban, and we end up with a no ban. And of course, Schalke hard punished us for it, almost taking us in the whole reverse sweep. So we think we have to go back to the drawing board. So it was two very convincing games, the first two games, and then you kind of just missed the ban in the third game. Like, were you just out of focus, or did grabs disturb you? What What was the idea there? Yeah, it was definitely just the uh, grabs. That's the reason that we <laughs> missed the ban. Um, I don't actually remember exactly who missed the ban, like which player exactly. Uh, it could have been anyone. Uh, it's hard to tell, but um, definitely very disappointing. Yeah. So I just got in my earpiece that it was actually you that missed the ban, the mid laner. So what do you have to say about it? Um, I, I don't remember anything. It was a long series. Game three was too far ago, so I, no, no comment. All right. So we see that we're gonna probably face Matt or Rogue uh, next time. So who are you looking forward to, and who do you think will win that best of five? So Ro Rogue usually looks to have the edge against the Mad Lions, so I would expect to play against them. But I wouldn't be surprised if we see another upset, or at least like a, a game five series, kind of like we saw today, because those are always fun when we're back on stage. But uh, I'm counting on seeing Rogue. All right, so we saw you pull out the illusion. Is like, is that your comfort pick in like the fifth game? Like, you just wanted to carry the last game, or like, why didn't you just finish it out trio? <laughs> so we, they left open the illusion game five. So we thought like we might as well just pick it, see if we can uh, can win the game. We managed to do it. Uh, of, of course, if we had gotten illusion game three, it would probably have been a bit better. But um, unfortunately, we we didn't pick it. So if you go back to recent history, we thought about that uh, Yanga said that Lilia was super OP. But this time around, we went 0-2 on it. What was like the plan going into the fifth game, knowing that we were 0-2 on our best pick, Lilia? So I think we just went a bit back to uh, to to like a, like a different meta. The games were very slow, so we felt like maybe just picking a tank and just tanking. And like I guess Volibear was just like diving everyone. So it seemed like Volibear was a bit better in the in the Schalke meta. But uh, let's see what the, n the next meta will bring. And now the most important question, how does it feel to be back on stage again? You know, we played a bit on stage at Worlds, but how does it feel to be back after one year on the LEC stage? Like, do you feel back at home? It feels good. It feels really good. That's all I can say. Of course, there's, uh, there's still the fans missing, but I know you guys are all cheering for us at home. So thank you guys. And being back at the studio feels great. And uh, yeah, we are going to go to the final and win it. <laughs> and that was all from Caps Recaps with Caps. Your boy Pinoy and Caps signing out.